Saving $2,400 on the 2020 Subaru Outback is actually considered to be a phenomenal deal. Let me explain to you why. I'm working on a $30,278 Outback Premium. If we take that MSRP, multiply it by 0.92, it brings us down to a selling price of $27,855. That's 8% off of the MSRP. Now what I want to do for you guys in this video is give you some targets as to what you should be shooting for, whether you're purchasing or you're leasing the 2020 Subaru Outback. What is happening guys? Ari here with Boston Automotive Consulting. And as always, this video is brought to you by SaveOnMyAuto.com. SaveOnMyAuto.com is a resource you can use so that you can shop around for the best possible deal. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing because this whole channel is dedicated to giving you everything you're gonna need to know so that you can negotiate your best possible deal. Now, I was just recently at a Subaru dealership over the weekend, I was given a $1,500 discount in which I took and shopped around. What I was gonna say, if you're in a state that has multiple Subaru dealerships, you gotta be filling out those contact us forms or request today's price, make an offer, whatever they have as a button to connect with that dealer, connect with them or use saveonmyauto.com to be put in touch with local Subaru dealerships. Ultimately, you wanna be targeting 8% or better. It may be a little bit difficult right now in the current market based off of the fact that the Outback just came out, but believe me, that much discount is in their rock bottom price. Subaru customers typically see 8% off of a Subaru as being a normal good deal. Targeting about a $2,400 to $2,500 discount on a $30,000 Subaru if you're purchasing is a phenomenal deal and bring in your own financing. Make sure that you're bringing in your own financing so you don't get any sort of rate markup above whatever Subaru will offer you as an interest rate. Going into leasing, you guys, the Subaru Outback's lease program is absolutely phenomenal and I'm excited for anybody that's considering leasing one because the program is immediately aggressive enough for those of you that wanted to lease out the Outback but were worried, yeah, it just came out, etc even at full price is a decent lease program, but target 8% like the following lease calculation that I'm about to give you. This month we're dealing with a 58% residual at 10,000 miles a year and an ultra low 0.0001 money factor coming from Subaru. Now plugging it all into the lease calculator and still going for 8% off, in essence, a 30,278 MSRP and a selling price of 27,855 and giving just the inception fee. So your first payment, acquisition fee, doc fee, registration, all that stuff due up front, roughly about 1620. We'd be talking about $308 a month that's including sales tax. So like I said before, ultimately going after 8% off may be a tad bit difficult if you don't live in a place like New England where we've got a ton of Subaru dealerships available to us. Shop around the deal, visit saveonmyauto.com, check off Subaru, put in your home and your work zip code. Just try to connect with as many dealerships as you can to try and get this 8% or this 300-ish a month. If you found this information useful, and you wanna see more of these new car buying and negotiation tip type videos, please consider subscribing. And don't forget to visit saveonmyauto.com as well as the resources down in the description below. Thank you so, so much for watching guys. We'll see you next time.